This is Linden Street, by the corner of Linden and Fermin, the school, the public school. As you guys can see there is a fire, it's a car burning down. We hear there is multiple cars burning. Probably fire, uh, electrical wires fell on top of the car due to the storm that we just experienced. It's been burning for a while now. They are just letting the car burn down completely. This is on Linden, Linden Street. Well, Lisa, uh, probably due to the storm, electrical wires fell on the car and ignited the car, the fire. That's, uh, that's my assumption. Malvin, you find that this is a good time to joke about something like that, really? Eileen, this is on Linden Street, right by, by Fairman by the school right by the public school i'm not sure if the street going up it's or down it's oak but right by uh on linden linden and uh and park hill ellen i don't don't really know if it was the battery or what actually ignited the fire as you guys can see they are not making an attempt to put the fire out firemen are just letting the car burn down e exactly by Enrico Furman that's exactly where this is So let me show you the area so you guys can see. Como empezó? How did the fire start? Hold on, let me turn this thing. That's it. So tell me, how did it start? A tree came down on Linden. Okay. 
and but it knocked the cables down and the then cables. one of the cables landed on the car and it caught on fire. Okay, so it was a tree that hit the wires, yes. wires, yes. flat. How it went? Only one car because I two heard cars. two cars, yes. two cars. And now what? They just let in the car burn down until until Carn Edison comes to close the No, they, they gotta shut the power down for them to throw water on the car. We can't do nothing until Con Edison comes in. Yeah, and they are all over Yonkers today. There is yes. things they happen all everywhere. So you heard it. A tree came down, collapsed on top of wires, W wires came down on top of the car <laughs> and there is two cars on fire can I go on that side can I go on that side and before the before the 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 tape over there So you guys heard me. I asked the officer if I could go get a little closer, but it tells me no, because they're trying to make sure no one crosses the line, because the transformers are up there, and uh, God forbid they come down. You know, the transformers come down on top of somebody. So they're doing this to protect, to protect the people, to prevent any injuries. As you guys can see, there is a patrol, a cruiser right here, preventing people from uh, walking through and traffic. Special thanks to Actor The Connector, creator, creator of Stop and Shake for this lead. He told me about uh, the fire and we, uh, we came down to, to document what's going on. Guys, Yonka's voice is the only place you need to be if you want to know what's going on real time about incidents or the, anything anything that happens on the street of Yonkers raw and pure well Con Ed is all over Yonkers today this is not the only incident there is this one there was a fire I believe on Park Hill Avenue there is other incidents all around the Yonkers. There is trees hitting houses. It's a whole bunch of things going on. So police is here. Uh, they there. Ambul uh, fire department is responding to many, many places. So and so is Con Edison. So it will take some time. 
So for, for right now, they're going to let the car burn. And just I think they're just concerned that this doesn't expand to any other cars. So far, two cars burned out. Okay, guys, it's starting to rain. So, uh, and there is not much more to see. Now it's just wait until that car is completely burnt out. As you guys can see, the fire is kind of uh, coming down, I guess. It was totally engulfed pr before. Angela, the cause of the fire, it's basically the storm, the root cause. Tree came down on wires, wires fell on top of the car, igniting two cars on fire. Basically, that's what happened on a nutshell. Guys, let me just give you a little bit of a warning in case you enjoy my page. I have almost no tolerance whatsoever for nonsense. So if you come with uh, stupid comments, nonsense, trying to make jokes in the middle of uh, something like this, or other, you know, other bad stuff that happened, I don't tolerate that at all. I will just block you on the spot. So, if you like my channel, if you like my page and want to remain on it, I would ask you to please watch what you say because not every single time it's time for a joke and I, I, I just don't have patience, my tolerance. I have tolerance for many things but not for stupidity. Marina, as far as I, as far as I know, as far as I know, there is no one hurt. That's as far as I know. But I got here long after the fire started, so I am not sure. So police officers are asking people to not to stay on the sidewalk. If you have to go through the tape, go into your house or stay inside your property. Alright guys, this is it. 